hello traders uh, in this video i'm gonna to talk about uh, one of the important tools uh, in the technical analysis that commonly used by the uh, many of the successful uh, traders and this tool known as uh, uh, fibonacci retracement actually we have two types of the fibonacci one of them is a retracement and one of them uh, is uh, expansion. In this video, we are focused on the Fibonacci retrace retracement. What's Fibonacci retracement? Actually, it is not important to fully understand the underlying theory or uh, concept behind this uh, tool, but uh, we, we should have a simple uh, information regarding this as it is a sequence of the numbers that actually are reoccurring in the universe and uh, these numbers uh, have a complicated uh, sequence we as we as i mentioned it is not uh, necessary to fully understand it as uh, many platforms uh, make it uh, automatic uh, for us and automatically calculate these uh, numbers for us and make it easy uh, to be used in uh, trading let's jump to the trading view and explain it on the chart okay uh, in the one hour time frame of the uh, gold spot okay uh, here if we calculate the correction or retracement for this big move here actually we bring Fibonacci tool as it is here in the menu we, we find the FIB retracement okay and for the downward move we put the starting point of the Fibonacci in the highest point okay as we see here highest point to the and drag it down to the lowest point okay lowest point of this movement okay as we see here from this point okay from this point to this point we expect some correction and retracement of this big downward move to these areas okay as we see here we see in the side of the fibonacci tool some numbers appear here okay the number one is a highest point starting from here and the zero is a lowest point okay and these numbers in between as we see what's important in the these numbers is 0.5 and 0.6 okay because actually the retracement of any move or corrective move for any impulsive move should be between 0.5 to 0.6 of the previous uh, impulsive move okay as we see here exactly exactly touching the 0.6 here okay exactly and sometimes only reach to the 0.5 this zone here let me bring a zone here this zone okay is the area for the liquidity okay and it is known as a golden zone okay golden golden zone why because there is a very good opportunity for us in this area okay very good opportunity in this area for us to sell in this case scenario for sell 
because it is necessary for this move okay it is necessary that the price should came should come back to the zero point and even for lower this lower after the zero is measured by the Fibonacci expansion okay actually Fibonacci retracement is used for the entry point okay as we enter here for the sell okay short and we expect that the price will come down to this area okay so it is a very good opportunity from this area to this area if we take we put the take profit one in this zero point we can even use a, a fibonacci expansion or other tools to uh, make another target even below this uh, zero point okay if we go back in the chart and use the fibonacci tool in uh, another uh, scenario this big impulsive move here okay as we see here the price go up to this high area okay we can uh, bring the Fibonacci from this lowest point in this case scenario the the trend is upward or the impulsive move is upward not downward okay we put in this time we put the starting point or one of the Fibonacci in the lowest point and put the second point or uh, ending point of the Fibonacci in the highest point or uh, zero okay and we expect after this impulsive move we expect some retracement downward okay and in here we uh, use the Fibonacci for measurement of this retracement uh, amount okay as we see here the price uh, came down for the exactly 0.5 percent of this previous impulsive move and this this is a correction okay correction of this impulsive okay this is a correction of this impulsive move okay here let's bring a area here is a golden area for buy in this case scenario for the previous case scenario was for the sell but in this scenario it is for the buy okay or buy as we see the price is go to this zero point came back to the zero point even even breaks the zero point and reach it the new high in this area the Fibonacci is working better in the higher time frames like hourly daily or weekly but we can actually uh, take benefit from it or use it in even lower uh, time frames like uh, 15 minutes or 5 minutes but it is more reliable in the uh, higher time frames hope you uh, uh, good trade